and me Sangeeta Mazumdar. I am in 5th grade. Today, I am going to explain my experiment rubber powered boat model. Its construction is very simple and can be easily built at home. It requires 6 ice cream sticks, 3 bottle caps, 2 skewers, 1 straw, rubber bands, plastic bottle and glue. First, take a plastic bottle and make two holes at the middle of the bottle parallel to each other like this to make the paddle. Now cut the bottle in the middle so that we can adjust the rubber fitments. Now take two bottle caps and make a small hole at the center like this. Cut the cap size to make grooves to create paddles like this. Now cut the ice cream sticks in half and create the paddle like this. Then pass the square through the center of the cap and glue them like this. Pass the square through the holes and fit the other bottle pa cap paddle and glue it like this. Now mark three points in the square and glue the square with small square pieces like this to create hooks for attaching the rubber band. Now take the long rubber band and pass it through the bottle's mouth and fix it with the bottle cap like this. Then wind the other end of the rubber with the help of hooks attached to the square. As we release the paddles, rubber starts unwinding which makes the boat move in water like this. The potential energy stored in the rubber makes the boat move in water. We can understand the behavior of potential energy by number of windings of rubber and the distance traveled by the boat. Now put the boat in the water and see how it moves. and the distance travelled by the boat. We can observe that as the number of windings increases, the boat travels more distance, which also means that the potential energy increases with the number of rubber windings. We can also try to wind the rubber in clockwise and anti-clockwise direction and see how the boat moves. This is anti-clockwise. We can see that as we wind the rubber in clockwise direction, the boat moves forward and with anti-clockwise direction, the boat moves backward. Note that we have created three hooks. Now, wind the rubber to each of the hook and observe the movement of the boat. Note to observations. It is fun to make and play with the rubber powered boat model. I hope you like this experiment. You can also build your own rubber powered boat model and enjoy the science like me. Thank you.